Khloe Kardashian is back at it again. She just can't seem to get past the fact that Jordan Woods is finally in a good place. She is thriving, she is happy, and honestly speaking, Chloe needs to cut the jealousy crap and move on. The real cause of the drama between Jordan Woods and the Kardashians is none other than Tristan Thompson. Tristan and Chloe's relationship has been a roller coaster ride. Their love story was filled with ups and downs, mainly because Tristan would rather unalive himself than keep it in his pants. It almost seems like the more effort Chloe puts into making things work, the more Tristan cheats and does whatever he wants. Cheating scandals and trust issues took a toll on their relationship, and Chloe tried really hard to make it work, but sometimes things are just not meant to be. You see, Tristan and Chloe first got together in 2016, and things seemed so amazing at first because they were just posting cute pictures together on Instagram and showing off their relationship to the world. The real drama began in 2017, when Chloe was literally about to give birth to True. There were rumors of Tristan cheating on her in a club, and at first no one believed it, but shortly after a video of Tristan actually making out with this girl leaked and it spread like wildfire. Everybody was in shock, wondering why Tristan would betray Chloe like that, and so many people expressed compassion for her because she had to deal with that on top of all the raw emotions that come with being a first-time mom. Despite the cheating scandal, Chloe tried to work things out with Tristan, and they started going to couples therapy. For a while, it seemed like they were on the path to recovery. They even celebrated True's first birthday together as a family, giving us all a glimmer of hope, like maybe they could work it out after all. But things took a 360-degree turn after that. Basically, in 2019, more cheating allegations surfaced, and these were way too close to home. TMZ revealed that Tristan was caught kissing Jordan at a house party right after he spent Valentine's Day with Chloe. The story that Jordan and Tristan were at his home late night or until 7 in the morning. They said they were, like, making out, and I immediately didn't believe it. You know, and I was like this can't be true. Jordan Woods then went on the red table talk to expose what really happened. Never once was I giving him a lap dance, making out with him, sitting all over him. On the way out, he did kiss me. This revelation caused a massive fallout between Jordan and the Kardashian family, and Chloe was devastated. And it seemed like the final straw in their already messy relationship, but for some reason, Chloe was still taking Tristan's side. She even tweeted, Why are you lying, Jordan Woods? At this point, Jordan basically became a target for the Kardashians. Chloe blamed her for her failed relationship all the time, and she even rallied her sisters to join in on the beef. It seemed like Tristan had no fault in the whole thing, which is crazy, because Tristan literally had a history of cheating, which was very public, by the way. Seriously, Chloe, shouldn't he take some responsibility, too? It's a bit unfair to go all out on Jordan while giving Tristan a pass. Let us not forget that Tristan had a whole baby with another woman while her was with Chloe. After that, Chloe and Tristan started working on their relationship, and it wasn't that long before they decided to have a second baby via surrogate. Shortly after, rumors started swirling about Tristan having a son named Theo with another woman. At first, people did not really believe her until she came out with screenshots of her and Tristan's conversations where he offered to give her money to deal with the pregnancy, if you know what I mean. He maintained that he wasn't the father until the DNA results came back positive, and he even issued a public apology to Chloe for hurting her. Nonetheless, he managed to steal her joy away from their second child, and Chloe is now angry that she's forced to be a mom to Tatum, the baby that she looked forward to having with Tristan and he's angry that he's forced to be a dad to Theo because of his actions. It's interesting how they treat their men when they mess up, but when it comes to the girls, they go all out. Talk about a double standard. They literally thought she was going to suffer like she would not go far without their name, but guess what? Jordan proved them wrong, especially since everyone thought Jordan was only friends with Kylie for fame and money. But that's not true in Jordan's case, because she stood by Kylie's side through thick and thin, supporting her in everything, even when being her friend took a toll on her. Since the whole Kardashian fallout, Jordan Woods has been slaying life. She's out here finding her own happiness, building her own brand, and doing amazing things. Who said you need the Kardashians in order to thrive? The funny thing is, the fans completely agree. A fan commented, The moment Jordan wasn't associated with the Kardashians, everything went up for her. She lost weight, got deals, found out who her true friends were, and now our good sis is getting married to a man who respects her. 
This is how you level up. Another fan said, I have always been disgusted by how they did Jordan. Chloe was the oldest, Tristan was in his 20s and the NBA, and Jordan was 19 and so much of the world fell for it. So gross, Chloe is gross. People went on and on, but Chloe wasn't as triggered until Jordan went public with her new relationship. After years of being close friends, Jordan Woods and Carl Anthony Towns' romance started heating up in 2020. They've been together for three years now, and they even celebrated their third anniversary in May. Now we have seen their anniversaries over the years through the pictures they post on their social media, but this one definitely got people thinking that they might be ready to take their relationship to the next level. In one of the posts, Jordan was spotted wearing what looked like an engagement ring on her finger, and fans are going crazy to figure out if it's true or not, because Jordan and Carl Anthony's relationship is everything Chloe ever wished to be with Tristan. I mean, they are literally the it couple of his basketball team. Meanwhile, Chloe is too embarrassed by Tristan's behavior to the point where she can't even show her face at a Lakers game. And unlike Tristan, every time there are cheating rumors going around, Carl immediately addresses them. Like the one time he tweeted, So I got the baddest girl in the game and you think I'm going to waste my energy with anyone else? Same haters we got now are going to be the same ones we have when I put that ring on her finger. At the end of the day, Jordan got her new man and a possible wedding on the way. Chloe, on the other hand, got karma for involving herself with another woman's man. Tristan embarrassed her so badly that everyone just feels sorry for her. Getting cheated on is one thing, but every one woman that your man cheats with being so public about it is a whole lot worse. Chloe should just move on and find happiness because Tristan really got her out here looking like Boo Boo the Fool way too many times. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you think Chloe will finally let go of Tristan and stop being bitter? Let me know and don't forget to like and subscribe.